Hey, we're here at the NAMM show. I'm here with Kitsch with Soundflow. Um, I'm interested to see. I've heard a lot of good things. What are you guys working on? Excellent, man. Yeah, we've got some great stuff happening. This year's our first year uh, at NAMM and uh, it's been great. We've had a great turnout, some uh, great producers coming by, mixed engineers, it's great. But we've got uh, a bunch of new things coming. Uh, we're delving into the world of AI. Uh, we're also, uh, we've got a, a mom deck uh, that has been designed uh, by Andrew Sheps, uh, the mixed engineer Andrew Sheps, wow. and um, uh, that's integrating uh, with the Dadman software, which is cool. And uh, yeah, the AI stuff is we've got like speech to, uh, to voice, uh, voice to text uh, recognition, and we've uh, linked that up with ChatGPT. Oh, so wow. we're, we're gonna try and work out different ways that we can uh, like automate uh, different uh, workflows um, with, yeah, with AI. Um, nice. So we've also um, got uh, a new Isotope RX package where we've got round trip workflows where you can uh, open your modules, you can send an audio file. So say I've got a Eclipse uh, selected here, I can send it over to Isotope RX and it uh, does all the settings. And then uh, in Isotope RX, I'll just close this wow, down. Wow, so you just press one button there. One, one and button, all that yeah, happens. and it sets it up. It sets it up clip by clip or continuous file, all the different settings that you want. And then inside Isotope RX, you can then open your different modules and you can uh, search the presets and go through, open the presets, you can render, preview, and do all that sort of stuff. And then with one button, you can send it back into Pro Tools and render it, and wow. it's, it's awesome. And we've also got uh, you know, the ability to, um, uh, in, uh, in Pro Tools, we can, uh, on, uh, on selected tracks, we can uh, open plugins with the uh, TZO's plugin loader, and we can, um, uh, with uh, the Shep's color deck here, you can actually name uh, the different colors, so you can recall the the you know the, the standard colors that you use all the time. Yeah. And uh, even better than that, let me just open this. Anyone who doesn't know about Bounce Factory, uh, Andrew Shep's, our, our, uh, one of our top developers. Uh, he has created this out app called Bounce Factory, and the amount of like uh, people that are just like blown blown away about what this does. Uh, I had uh, the producer Baines here the other day, and uh, he came up and he said uh, uh, he called his girlfriend to say that he could uh, go and hang out because he was just uh, clicking bounce all on Bounce Factory, and he went away and uh, hung out with her for a while while Bounce Factory bounced all of his uh, Atmos stems and all his. Uh, you know, all, all these tracks, his vocal up, vocal down, a cappella mix and everything. All so, ready yeah, to so go. instead of, you know, if you want to output stems of, you know, this type of stem, this type of stem, or any other configuration that requires you to configure it and then bounce, configure it and then bounce. Exactly. You can make a list of those, press bounce all, yeah. get back to your life, and, and then come back later. And the great thing cool. is, it doesn't just work in a single session, it works over multiple oh, sessions. Wow. So, you can do like solo passes, mute passes everything and you can set all the settings up that are regular to Pro, uh, Pro Tools and each snapshot will remember everything that it is uh, that it's part of it. So it's absolutely brilliant. He's also got some other apps that are out. Um, uh, he's got like a MIDI factory uh, app uh, which is really uh, super cool and um, uh, also a, uh, a counter, where, an offset counter where um, you know when you sent a session uh, that it doesn't start at zero uh, you can actually set the zero point. So if you need to locate, uh, you know, they, where an artist says, I'd like the guitars to come up at one minute, seven seconds, you can then um, use the offset counter to go to that place. And uh, and yeah, it's great, yeah. Super, super handy. Uh, it but sounds like it's basically up to your imagination at that point, uh, is it's, that true? It's great, we've got a, a brilliant community that uh, um, they, uh, they, they upload their own packages that they've created. So, um, uh, and we've got a great forum. Our community loves like to help everyone out, out and uh, we just come up with great things. And we like look into the future. We've got so many great ideas. It's just a matter of time before we get uh, everything that we want. Wow, you said this is your first NAMM show? First NAMM show. Ooh, so I'm excited to see what happens. Can we get the camera in a little closer? Yeah, man. Because you're using Stream Decks here, right? Yeah, we've got, uh, is... we've got support for Stream Decks. Uh, even the uh, Stream Deck Plus uh, will be coming very shortly. And uh, we also use uh, iOS and Android devices as supported. Uh, we've also got MIDI, de uh, MIDI devices, uh, OSC devices, HID devices, and you can even use keyboard, sh uh, keyboard shortcuts. And uh, not only that, we've got triggers that allow you to, uh, to uh, load decks and surfaces on, on your devices, uh, depending on like whether Windows show 
or whether an application is in focus. So a lot of our users just have like a single one of these or one of these and uh, depending on what they're doing in their DAW, they're able to switch uh, and make things look good. Man, yeah. I can see you saving people a lot of a lot of time yes. in their workflow yeah, doing this. Yeah, it's great. It's wonderful. And I get you know if, if you're doing this for your own music, that's one thing. You get to do your music in less time. But if you're working for somebody, yes. I can see that being very valuable to both you and the person you're working for. Great. You're Excellent. gonna get more done in less time poking around making things happen. Right? Fantastic. Yeah. That's great. So be sure to uh, head to soundflow.org and okay. uh, and sign up for a, a, a we've got a, like a free trial, a 30-day trial. And it's a nine dollars ninety nine uh, a month subscription, and uh, it gives you access to a Pro Tools package, which has over sixteen hundred pre built uh, scripts and macros for Pro Tools, and then the new Isotope package, which has over two hundred and eighty uh, scripts and macros uh, ready to be customized uh, for you to use with uh, your workflows. And you get that all for nine ninety nine, or is that the trial? Month. Whoa! So nine ninety nine is the and price. we're constantly cool. doing updates and uh, and and pushing out things for um, that. Uh, we get from our, our beta team members, ideas that we get from our beta team mem members, it's great. Before I go, I'm interested to see this AI thing. Oh, okay. So, yeah, help me Let me see if I can work this that. out. Can you hold on to this yeah, sure. for me? Okay, so uh, this is very uh, new. So if I grab this microphone here, mm -hmm. uh, I've got these, uh, these buttons here. So I've got uh, voice to text. Uh, so if I hold down this button and, uh, and I go, uh, welcome to the Soundflow booth. And it instantly writes it on the screen like that. But the best thing is, is we've uh, integrated it with ChatGPT. So uh, you can, um, uh, uh, let me see. So if I went, um, um, uh, write a song about giraffes. And obviously ChatGPT needs to do its, uh, its thing uh, in the background. So while wow, this is blue, and then it'll come up here and write some song lyrics about gi giraffes. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so it's uh, any moment now. There we go. There it is. Great, there it is, great. <laughs> So, um, and we've also got things like, you know, if you're in the studio and, um, and you're, you're sick of, um, uh, you've had a long day and you need to, to write a polite email, you can, you can go over here and, and, and select this one and say, you know, that mix was terrible. And then it will re rewrite the email very politely. Oh, yeah, I see. So, it's the very polite Yeah, very button. polite button. Okay, so that's you don't right. even have to be polite. It'll do it for it you. It will do it All for right, you, see. exactly. Cool. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> nice. yeah. So, Man, yeah. that's really exciting. Where do you see that going in the next few years? Oh, so many places. We'd love to apply it to controlling DAWs for, you know, for bouncing mixes, for just generally making, uh, taking the tedious tasks out of the way that we currently work. You know, it's, uh, we, there are so many monotonous tasks that we do that it's, it'll be nice to have that yep. taken care of and allow us to get back to the creativity. You know, um, you know our catch line is uh, create more, click less. And if we can make the AI help us create more and we can click less, that's great. Nice, yeah, because right now the, the AI, it's exciting, but you still would have to go to it, you know, write in Absolutely, manually. Man. But if we can integrate it with your system here, I mean, it's just another preset here. It's another button exactly. that you can speak into it and it becomes an assistant that yep. actually fits in within your fact, flow, huh? That's funny you say assistant because that's what it's called, virtual assistant. Cool. So yeah. Really yeah. cool, man. I'm glad yeah. I stopped by. Oh I, man, it's so I can't great believe thing. it's your first name. That's yeah, no, it's we're, an awesome we're product already. We're cool. It's well, thank cool. you for your time. Kids. Yeah, thanks, Kyle.